Hi, Dan the Man here again, uh, once again demoing SNE Mole DS. I just recently figured out that my camera had this macro feature that lets me actually get good close-up shots, and I'm feeling stupid for not having used it for my other videos. Regardless, this time I'm using the newest uh, 0.5 Alpha 2 version. Supposedly it fixes some of the issues that were created in the first Alpha, alpha version. Alright, one of the first ones I'm going to demo today is uh, Darius Twin. It's another shoot 'em up game, but let's see. Okay, I'm going to need to change the settings here. I'm going to change it to weight V blank because I like to do that to limit it to 100%. Interrupt speed hat. Yeah, this died. Yeah, so I'm not very good at this game. Again, I can't really see things very well from this point of view, but regardless, I, sh I shouldn't suck as much as I do. <coughs> Aside from some intermittent sound skipping, it plays pretty well. Very enjoyable. And I just died. Oh well. And as I've been demoing each of the Donkey Kong Country series, I might as well do the third one today. Got Donkey Kong Country 3 here. Now this is running at no V blank. So it's a little bit faster than it should be. Now, I've had issues with uh, the game crashing when I try to enter this level here in the Lost World, so I'm not going to do that this time. It's an issue that I've determined to be uh, started with the version 0.5 alphas. Uh, 0.4 did not have the issue. On a related note, with e all of the Donkey Kong Country series, they work just fine in 0.4, so if you feel like you... Uh, if you feel like it's not working too well in the newer ones, feel free to downgrade, actually. Like, for instance, here, I'm not actually running at quite 100%, even with no V-blank off. Or with no V-blank on, sorry. I'm running at around, say, 85 to 90 most of the time. Because version 0.4 uses the older but faster tile engine, you might want to use that instead in order to get a faster gameplay. Now, note that this is only because of HDMA in this level. That's why it's being so slowed down. I'll show you the second level in a minute, and you'll see that it goes much faster. Most of the seaside levels like this use HDMA, while other levels don't. Like here, the second level... Now, since I have no V-Blank on, it's going to go way too fast. Let's see. Oh, that was smart. Stupid. Yeah. Okay, that was ridiculous. Can't see what I'm doing with this angle. Alright, I've got to redo that. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, and here's another issue I found with 0.5. Graphical corruption. You can see that it's really not supposed to be like that, and I don't know why it is. Um, the only method I've found to fix this is to just reboot the DS. So, it, once again, this is an issue found only in 0 0.5. 0 0.4, final, uh, beta, alpha, whatever, they all uh, play the game fairly well without this graphical corruption. So I'm going to move on to a different game. 
Uh, let's see. Arkanoid do it again. It's a good one. Not sure if that's a misspelling or if they meant to say do it again or do or whatever. Who knows? Alright. And I believe this is one where you used to have to modify the background settings. But given that Donkey Kong Country 3, the first level, you no longer have to do that. Maybe you don't. I haven't tested it yet. Perhaps I should have done that before making the video. Who knows? Yep, definitely gotta fix it. Okay, if I remember right, I had to disable background 3. That's not right. No, heck if I know. Let's see, turn sprites on and... Let's do 1 and 2, see if that works. Sure. Yep, that looks right. Actually, in fact, I think you just had to uh, change the priority. And didn't have to actually... There we go. See? It's your basic breakout game. Kind of slow pace at the beginning, but it gets better. As you can see, it works pretty well. Full speed. What little sound there is does work. Not the most audibly uh, intensive game. I lose. Okay. That's enough for that game. Hit the wrong game by accident. And the last one I wanted to show you is one of my personal favorites. Although, I don't know why. Mickey Mania. It's a Disney game. It's actually quite difficult. Uh, in fact, for this one, I actually have used a Game Shark or Game Genie tool in order to give myself infinite energy and marbles. Yes, it's cheating, but it lets me actually beat more than the first level, which is nice. Let's skip that. All right, let's see. Wait, V-blank, probably Cycles would be good. Yep. Yeah, running at 90%. Let's see if Interrupt... Hey, it can handle Interrupt. Let's use that then. Speeding it up because I hate waiting for this. Wait, V blank. Okay. Don't know why it was screwing up earlier. Come on. Yeah, the music is really kind of skipping. Again, another game that works perfectly fine in 0.4 which is probably what I'll use for playing this. It's mostly because uh, if you want full speed and you want 0.4, you'll use the tile engine, which is faster. The line-by-line -line engine is more accurate, though, so, you know. Depends on the game, really. If the game runs fine in 0.4, that's what I would suggest, but if it needs 0.5, then use that. Yeah, I really don't think it's supposed to do that. Alright, you get the idea. And one more thing I wanted to demo. Not sure if I have time. I've got one minute. Alright. Mario Paint. Again, this has already been demoed, but... Alright, let's see. Start. Sorry. There. Okay. And there you go, high pocket heaven. I'm out, Dan the man.